girl a running in a group. She had a high-speed motor in a 44 coupe. She had a racing cam and a supercharge. Look at Buddy Hotter, Rod and Large. She's a hot rod. She's a hot rod. She's my hot rod, baby. Just a block away from the ultimate grocery getter, we have the Elvis car that they've been advertising all week. A 1974 Cadillac Sedan DeVille that Elvis bought and turned into a station wagon to haul his equipment back and forth. This is quite a car, and believe me, it's not all pink, just the top. It's a white Cadillac with pink striping and a pink vinyl top. Wow. The only Cadillac I ever saw made into a station wagon was a hearse. Big George, your car guy, live at the Whiting Cruise Night once again, and we have found the love of my life, a 1923 Model T Coupe owned by Ed Greger. Ed, tell me a little bit about this car. Well, um, I got it, believe it or not, from the end of my block. It uh, belonged to an old neighbor of mine, and uh, he had bought it back in the 60s and with the intent of restoring it and kind of never got around to it. It sat in his garage and, and collected dust, and then he passed away, unfortunately, and his family was selling it, and I bought it that very day. And uh, then I, over the course of about a year and a half, took it down to the frame and restored it completely. Wow, Ed, that's a story and a half. Let me just tell you, this thing is beautiful. No, that's great. I mean, that people like this kind of stuff. That is outstanding. You. And you did a great job on this, and you did this yourself. I did it all myself. Uh, the only thing I didn't do was uh, I had the machine work on the engine done by Ryan Racing and Gary. I did all the assembly, but they did the machine work, and I had to have the glass cut by a glass firm. But otherwise, everything was my own two hands, so... Wow, Ed, I'm really, I'm telling you, this is a great car. This looks like something that, this, this, we have a real old DJ at WJOB. His name is Gino's Ferusa. You didn't buy this from him, did you? No, he's too old. <laughs> well, Gino, that answers the question, buddy. 